Right, I'm not going to spend a lot of time on how to apply Ming Coil. It's fairly simple. You make sure your leather is clean. Uh, you take a cotton ball, you can do a light coating, or you can take a sponge like I have and do a heavy coating. Regardless, you cover the whole surface with Ming Coil. Make sure everything's covered. Once that's done, then you take, I, what I do is if you do a heavy coat, you let it sit for a little bit, and then you wipe it off. I wiped it off right away, but usually you let it sit for a little bit, and then you wipe it all off with a paper towel. That's what I do. Same thing with a little uh, uh, clip holder here. I just smeared mink oil all over it, and then I just wiped it off. I did a little bit of beveling just to clean it up a little bit, too. Uh, I, ideally, you do that in advance, and I do that to the side pieces. So everything's coated in mink oil, good to go. Uh, just the primary thing to worry about is that uh, the surface is clean, that you get a good coating on there, and that you make sure you take off all the excess. That's it. Applying mink oil is actually a very simple process. Once you've wiped off the excess, let it, uh, let it sit, whatever you want to do. I, I didn't wait too long myself, to be honest with you. Uh, I did take a Q-tip, and I poked it through the, the bigger holes to try and clear them out. But the smaller holes, I just left the mink oil in there. I figured when I push the needle through, it'll clear those holes of the excess mink coil and provide an extra barrier. So that's what I did with that. General rule of thumb, one more time on the procedure, clean the leather, apply the ink oil either lightly with a cotton ball or heavily with a sponge, wipe off the excess, and then once that's done, and then you can start working the rest of your project. It's pretty straightforward. Now, as far as reapplying mink oil, there's different suggestions for that. Some say you have to reapply every year. Uh, personally, I don't recondition leather unless it looks like it needs it. It's that simple. So there you have it. That's applying ink oil. It's a very... Str uh, mink oil. Sorry, it's a very straightforward process. Thanks for watching. The next video will be how to do buttons. I hate doing buttons, but yeah, there you go. It's an important part of this making leather works.